Hey guys, my name is Kaushik and welcome back to Let Code. In this video, we are going to learn the advantage of using Playwright over the Selenium. It's going to be a very simple demo, but in upcoming days, I will upload more uh, small videos just to make you understand the real advantage of using Playwright. So you might have already heard about Playwright and you know that it's super cool, but most of people give you uh, explanation about why it's good but i'm going to give you the explanation how it works also okay so let me start with a very simple test and this is very uh, common in selenium we might face this a lot of time that is stale element reference exception right for example here we have a uh, a simple form to login just enter your credential do the login and here you can see like we have a drop down so if i click like price low to high so the page will internally refresh and give you a fresh data so here you can see like uh, we have some data now if i go and interact with the same drop down now if i switch to high to low then of course the page is going to refresh internally and it's going to give you the data so this is the same script the i mean yeah the script is the same so we have this implicit weight also and we know that implicit weight is going to work only for two methods one is the find elements and find elements um i mean find element and find elements yeah so here we have the login and here we are uh, using the tag name we have found the drop down and of course we have to use the select class so first one is low to high low hi the value is low to high and then we are getting the uh, product name so this is the product name we are getting that and then we are just using the get text to print that and then we have the same drop down so already we have this drop down right so we are using the same drop down and we are trying to change the value from high to low okay so these are uh, just your elements i hope you know all this and then we are printing the text again okay so here we have like a text the first time and then we are printing the text again okay so very simple test right so if i go and execute this now by the way i'm using the latest selenium version 4.10 okay and here we got this exception like state stale element reference exception and a stale element not one okay so this is the common exception we get in selenium i hope you know what is this so basically we are trying to interact with the same element but since the page is internally refreshing the element is not there at that moment so it's going to give us the stale element reference now what is the advantage of playwright compared to selenium in this situation let's see okay so i have this very same script you have your login and we found the uh, select locator the drop down and from there we have select option called low to high and we are finding the first inventory name and uh, that means uh, this this guy okay so and here i'm using dot first that means uh, it will try to find the first element because in selenium by default uh, for example let me just inspect and show you this class name it's basically the multiple thing okay so it's basically multiple or you can say like we have one of six but selenium obviously interact with the first element so we won't get any exception but in play right um, it the locator function always try to find multiple so we are saying like hey we don't have to find multiple we just want to find the first one that is the only difference here okay then uh, using the product we are printing the text text content similar to your get text and then using the same drop down i am switching to high to low and i am again printing okay now if i go and execute this particular test let's see what happens It launched the browser. That's it. It over. It took around less than three seconds, I guess. And if you go to the console, you can see like uh, first one is for low to high. We got this this one on C, I guess. And then we got the fleece jacket, right? So that is what we have. So if you go to low to high, you have this on C. And then if you go to high, uh, fleece jacket. So we got both the stuff, right? Now, if you see the difference between selenium and playwright in selenium when we found the price drop down at the first time if you try to reuse the same 
since the page is internally reloading we are ending with an exception stale element reference which is very common in selenium you will you will face that lot of time if your page is really dynamic and you see the play rate script also same i found the drop down only once and i have reused that again and again i have found the product also once and i have like reused it again so i don't have to find so this is how playwright will avoids the stale element if you want to know the difference between playwright locator function this particular function and there is also a called element handle function if you want to see if you want to know the difference you can refer to this particular video okay now yeah so coming back to the selenium is there any solution of course there is a solution it's a very simple solution it's like you can uh, find the element once again so since the value is like once the page refresh refresh the value will go from the web element so you have to just find it one more time so for example i can simply uh, do like this uh, yeah and i can again refine this and then i can say this one and here also i have to print find the element and then i have to print so i'll just do this okay now if i go and run this it will give us all the console logs without any exception and there are multiple way to handle the uh, uh, tail element but yeah finding the element once again is really easy so you can see we got the same output as well okay so i hope you are able to understand of course it's not like we cannot achieve with selenium we can achieve the what the difference i want to convey here is the out of the box things so if someone is trying selenium for the first time they will might end up with the exception they have they might not know how to refine the element and use it right but in play right it's very simple just you find once and you can reuse even if you go back to another page and you come back to the same page you can still able to use the same locator that's the beauty okay i hope you like the concept and you also learn the difference if you have any queries feel free to ask me in the comments if you have any open discussion do let me know in the comments Ta-da, bye bye take care